Christensen. The outside handball to Taylor Hunt, the tagger, from a difficult angle. Didn't get all of the footy for the second time already in this game. Stokes to Motlock. Motlock did. Geelong have got the first two of this one. And goes back to Corey. Corey just gets it forward. Taylor Hunt's there. So is Blitzarves over the back. Hawkins overrun it. Soccer off the ground. No, he picks it up. Blitzarves a big man. No one presenting at the ball. So he just goes long and deep. Pods has got no one in the back. He can't. There he is from his favourite range. And Geelong have got four goals, lead by 17. In right now. Had a little look out the corner of the eye. Gentleman James Kelly marks. Well, that the control of this game they've got. Very close to the man on the mark there, Kelly. He knew the distance would test him. He's got it. That's <laughs> opportunity. Selwood tackled. And a little bit of a clip from Hill as well. Correctly. Joel Selwood directly in front to make it a goal apiece in the second quarter, and he does. It's really good, and it sets this up. Look at this. Nerdy to make it difficult for the Hawks. Comes in on the left. Looks good. Hunt's running again here, but they've got the free on. It's Murdoch again. He can unbelievably kick two goals in a row. Or is it Stringer? It's Stringer gets the goal for Geelong. Which gives it to Hunt. Haven't seen him kick on the right too often, but he made a good fist to this. Got it long and deep. 33-point cat lead comes in and makes no mistake. But don't argue by Duncan. They're coming on strong now, the Cats. And Caddy marks in the pocket. Caddy uh, comes in, kick on the way. Bending, Benny, he's got it. He Played on, said the umpire. Stringer goes back inside 50. Here's a chance for the Cats. Running hard at the footy. Got it here, Murdoch around the corner, kicks the goal. The goal of his life. Been decided by and tonight. Doesn't disappoint. Another classic. Siren sounds. Kenneth's curse has forever cursed the Hawks. And Geelong have won by 10.